How's it gaming guys? I'm Phil the Blanks and welcome to Tiny Toon Adventures Bab's Big Break for the Game Boy. Uh, this Let's Play was brought to you by Danny Casey. If you're interested in picking a game for me to do as a quickie on my channel, go to my Patreon page. There's a huge list of quickies for you to choose from and details on how you can get me to dedicate an episode to you. Babs is dreaming about becoming... Oh, it's one of those games where you can't skip the story. An actor is great. She is daydreaming that... She has great courage. Intelligence. Come on, man. <laughs> and power. Uh, those games where they were like back in the day and they didn't want it to go too fast for the kids. I'm like, I'm a grown up now. I can read. Yes, I am dreaming about those things the narrator just said. Becoming a star. Oh, Babs. <laughs> Even though I have natural acting talent. I still should study acting. Well, I mean, yes, yes. Even if you feel you're amazing at something, you should still study. Let's study acting and get into the th into the theater. So this is obviously based on Tiny Toons Adventures as soon as possible. Uh, back in, I think it's like 92 or 93 when the show started. I have no idea. Jeez, Plucky, you look angry. Hey, did you hear what Bab said? It's like, you guys look like you're gonna beat her up. Yes, I did. She'll make a fine offering to the gods. No, a great actress. Why are you so angry then? But, oh, okay, the but, but starts here. If she travels by herself, she'll get beat up by us three. We don't know what she'll do. Oh, so this, this is apparently a game about three men who don't trust the judgment of a woman. <laughs> Maybe we should follow her and make sure she doesn't get into trouble. I mean, I guess they care about her, but it's bad. She can get out of trouble herself. Hey, now that I think about it... Oh, Hampton. You're the only one who does look angry. I'm hungry. And that's apparently your only character in this game, is that you are hungry. Good enough. All right, so yeah, this is Tiny Toon Adventures. Uh, it's called Bab's Big Break. I don't know why it doesn't say it right here, but let's go in there. Uh, we have... Oh, oh, no. Okay. <laughs> let's say, don't do the story all over again. Uh, okay, let's... Oh, here I can make it go as fast as I want. Let's begin. To be a good actress, you need two things. Talent and luck. Oh, that's actually pretty true. But even these aren't enough when someone puts a mountain in your path. Luckily, I have friends like Dizzy Devil to help me out. So let's get to it. All right, let's get to it. Press the button. Buttons. Thank you. Ah, the classic theme. So, even though Babs is the one talking about the stuff, you play as Buster, or you press the pause button, you can play as Plucky or Hampton. They all share lives, so it doesn't matter who you play as, really. The real big difference is that when you get projectiles, for, oh, excuse me, for example, carrots for Buster, whoop, it's like a Castlevania axe, basically. And uh, with, um, actually, I don't know what they are for the other ones, let me see. The watermelons I know are Hampton, which are like bowling balls, I think. Yeah, yeah, ooh, there it goes. Well, take that guy. Uh, Pluckies, what's Pluckies do? Oh, oh, that doesn't sound very useful at all. I'll just stick to Buster. I'll switch around. I'll probably play as uh, different characters, probably different levels. Uh, so yeah, it's it's a basic hop and bop slide scroller. Except I like how instead of um, jumping underneath the blocks, you have to jump on top of them. They go bleh and give out the items. Pretty cute. So yeah, Danny chose this. According to him, this was a huge. Oh, I can't jump on them. Huge game uh, in his childhood. So I was like, yeah, screw it. I have it. Absolutely do this. Oh my god. I've never played it, uh, other than like trying out the cartridge, because every game I get, I try it out to make sure it works, obviously. Don't want to get caught with a game that doesn't work, you know, years down the road when I finally actually start playing it. So it works just fine. But I've never played this one. The only Tiny Toon game that I have ever played was the uh, one for Super Nintendo, which was Buster Bust Loose, which was a great one. Uh, but I figured they're all made by Konami, and this is back when Konami did really good things, so can't be that bad. Can't be that bad. We got pipes here. Whoop! The log that does pipes. Which, I mean, any hop and bop game back in the day, if you were in the forest or if you were a bunny, oh god, that was really close, uh, then that's just gonna be the way the way it is. Controls are like really slippery when I turn around and stuff. It's a little crazy. But yeah, so Danny grew up with this game, so I was more than happy to do it for him. Punk, I'll teach you. Why are there crabs? Why are there crabs down here? Oh no, they're maybe not crabs? No, they're bugs of some sort. So yeah. But also very 90s in the sense that even though the game is about Babs, you still have to play as the three guys, because you don't play as Babs in this game. Unless there's this 
like a spot I, I don't know about or something, so. we Uh oh, missed that. But yeah. Oh wow, all the diamonds come back. That's kinda weird, I didn't know that. It's a little odd. But whatever. I don't know what the diamonds do. I think they're for like mini games. Um I watched a little bit of this on YouTube just to kind of make sure this was doable in an hour or less, or around an hour is basically my kind of rules for quickies. So. So hopefully I'll do okay. I can't imagine it being fairly, like, difficult. I mean, I say that, but there are plenty of kids' games back in this day. Oh, hey, Dizzy. Uh, that, that are really difficult, so maybe. Me, Dizzy, and me know where to find Pretty Bunny. Grr. Me spin through mountain. Dizzy love rocks, grr. It's true. Oh, cool. Uh-oh, you need Dizzy help. Okay, if you say so. Oh, that must be like to bust through the mountain like Babs was saying. That's pretty cool. I like that. So yeah, Tiny Toons Adventure. Great show. It was um, back when uh, Warner Brothers really wanted to compete with Disney, because Disney pretty much ruled the uh, like afternoon cartoon kind of scene. Only Dizzy help here. Thank you, Dizzy. Did I play as him? Nope, nope. It was by itself. Fair, very fun. Um, and yeah, so, so Warner Brothers and like Spielberg helped out too, and they made a bunch of really cool things. Animaniacs was the big one for me, but Tiny Toons was also pretty huge. It's basically just Looney Tunes, but made for the 90s with new characters. Dizzy Hungry, Bye Bye Grr. Uh, and almost every character in the Looney Tunes has kind of like a younger version of themselves in this. Obviously, Buster and Babs are based off of uh, Bugs Bunny. And uh, then you have Plucky Duck, who is basically just uh, Daffy Duck. Damn you. Oh, do I have an extra? I have an extra heart there. Cool. I started with like two hits. Oh, whatever. Uh, Hampton is, um, is Porky Pig. Uh, Dizzy Devil is the Tasmanian Devil. There's a lot of uh, a lot of different ones, obviously. We'll see them throughout this game, I'm assuming, some of them. Jeez, um, I don't know if you guys can see that. That is... Holy crap. Thank goodness I'm recording this at 30 frames per second. Because this is really, really hard on my eyes. Oh my god. Oh, jeez. Is it better like this? No, it's not. Oh, my God. I gotta get out of here. Holy. It's, if you can't see it, it's flashing red and orange really quickly. There we go. Jeez. Oh, boy. All right. Note to self. <laughs> Don't have a seizure while you play this game. Damn it. Nah. Oh, crap, crap, crap. I hate when I do that. Run right into the enemy while, he, while I'm invincible. I don't do anything out of it. No, no, no. Get away. But yeah, no, it was a good show. I liked it a lot. My favorite character, um, I don't know. It's a good question that I'm asking myself, apparently. Um, I remember liking uh, Go Go Dodo a lot. Can I not get up there? Oh, okay, whatever. Um, he was like uh, the Dodo, basically, which wasn't in a lot of Looney Tunes. But you, yeah, oh God, did not expect that. Did we beat the level? Okay, I guess we did. And, uh, oh, boss, nice, there's Dizzy Devil. He was a boss in the Super NES one. Dizzy very hungry. Maybe a nice person to help me find yummy snacks. Me have idea. You help Dizzy. Grr, drop food in Dizzy mouth. Party. Easy enough. I guess. Oh, cool. <laughs> very cute. Um, yeah, I liked... I liked. Um, Dizzy was cute. This is a cute idea for it. Oh, he wants fish, right? Probably doesn't want the spiky things. Like sea urchins. Uh, but like even like... Ah, oh, jeez. Ah, damn it. Um... Like even you know, Sammy Sam had like a, a a child version of him, and that was like um, Montana Max in this one. It was really just cool how many characters they kind of make, and a lot of them were based on characters you don't really see in Looney Tunes all that often. Like I said, like with uh, Gogo Dodo, it was based on Dodo. Uh, we had like Elmira, who was based on like kind of Elmer Fudd, but like a girl version of him. It's kind of weird. Uh, you had like Shirley Shirley the Loon, who was based on I have no idea. It's a character that you do not see very often. Um, I was gonna say Daisy Duck, but that's that's Disney, so definitely not that. Eat the fish. But yeah, Gogo is probably one of my favorites. I like Dizzy a lot. Like I said, um, I think everyone remembers Baby Plucky. He was he was huge, almost like a meme before memes were a thing. But out of the two, I'd, I'd say I like Anime Next better. I guess I don't know. I have to watch them again. I mean, I know I'm an adult, but I'm a, I'm a big kid at heart. I'd watch these again. I mean, James might watch them, so when he's when he's a little older, so I'll watch them with him. Enough food, dizzy. Nope, not yet. All right. You had kind of a similar boss battle in the, in the Super NES version, which I think came up probably after this, I assume. But yeah. 
be honest, I like the um, the sprites. They look really good. Like the character select screen, they look fantastic for a Game Boy game. Food make dizzy tired. Me go to sleep now. Oh, nice points. Thank you. Um, I figured for each level we'll try a different character, so. Phew, all this studying is too much for me. Time to take a break from the books. Let's go to the city. We didn't even see you, Babs, in that level. Who knows, maybe we'll learn about acting there. In the city? That makes sense. If we get lost in the alleys, we can always call on Furball. Come on. Oh, yeah, Furball. Furball was, like, based on, I guess, Sylvester the Cat. But Furball doesn't talk. Um, though I guess there was an age, um, when Sylvester didn't talk. But everyone got used to, like, the fucker, the fucker, the fucker tash, you know? That kind of thing. But I think, like, early, early on, he didn't say very much. It's like Wile E. Coyote, how we're used to him not saying anything. Oh, I gotta switch characters. Um, but he he did in some cartoons when he was, like, talking to bugs in some some episodes. I don't know. There was, like, Loon Tunes were going on for so long that there's, like, different portrayals depending on, like, who was creating the, the shorts. So there's different, like, versions of each character in that sense. Eh. I guess the pineapple actually really works well in this level. That's good. I do down here. Careful, don't spit on me. Okay, good. <laughs> Plucky. Plucky is basically just Daffy. Almost to a T. I like his, like his jump where he looks right at you like, Yeah, what are you thinking? Huh? Hmm? Huh? Oh, up we go. Oh. Oh, this is very Mario 3. It's also very slow, jeez. Uh, there's just diamonds down there, I guess. I don't really need them. Um, keep going up. Oh, hello. Uh, I don't know what to do. I don't have any pineapples left, and I'm dead. Damn it. I hope this continues in this game, because I'm going to die. It's one of those things where I'm always like, I hope I... Ah, damn, I'm all the way back here. It's like, I hope I don't need to have, like, played the game before to be any good at it. Now I'm like, maybe I do. I mean, only two hits is pretty... Like, that's not, like, exactly. That's not a lot of hits. Two hits. Jeez. I had three hits with, with B uh, Buster in the first level. I wonder how I got that. I did get a heart, so maybe that increases as well as, as um, fills you up. I'm just gonna keep going, see if I need to go there, I don't know. Oh, I'm like back here. Oh, that brought me all the way back up. Okay. Oh, jam, damn, 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 I'm gonna hit that, okay. How do I get up there, though? Jeez. Uh, jump on me, okay. It's like, who can I jump on, who can't I jump on? Oh, this keeps going up. I am learning as I play. This game is very fundamental for me. I still don't know what the diamonds do, though I might have skipped something in the first level knowing me, damn it. I'll just keep bouncing for a while. <laughs> oh, I'm up here. Oh. oh. This is like a maze. Yeah, dang. Alright, let's try the other one then. Oh good, he's already dead. Up we go. I was about to say, please don't be able to hit me while I'm in the pipe. That would suck. That is really slow. I guess I gotta find Furball, though. In the first level, I gotta find Dizzy, so I assume I gotta find Furball. So, Furball was cute. He's, oh, jeez. Oh, what to say? That would suck. Oh, is that the end? Oh, yay. Oh, and the nice music back. Yay. A little loony. <laughs> oh, I remember that guy. That's like the Pitbull. Oh, jeez. I was about to say, I'm getting hit here. That's the Pitbull. I think his name is Arnold. Uh, I think he's not based on any specific character. Please don't start at the beginning. Oh, good. Okay, so each, like, area kind of has its own thing. That's, that makes sense to me. Nope. Haha, -ha, I'm so smart. But I'm also in my last life. Which, again, hopefully this game has... Uh, the game overs. Can I go out there? Arnold, where are you, man? I'm like, lure him over here. Oh! Yeah, there we go. Nice. Ooh, nice. Oh, careful. Ah, there it is. So I do get an extra heart that way. Oh, I like how, like, the mist there makes an actual, like, angry face. That's actually a really cool thing. Konami Man, back in the day, they really knew what they were doing. Oh, hey, Furball. Uh, this is Furball. Oh, yeah, I love how he doesn't actually talk. He just kind of narrates for him. Babs went to the train station. If you play hide and seek with him, he'll help you on your way to the train station. Find which trash can he's in. Jump out of the uh, garbage can you think he's in. And press any button. Will you play with him? Well, yeah. Let's play three times. All right. Oh. Oh, that was cool. Um, looked like it was the middle one. Uh, this one, yes. Yay! This is tough. I love it. Uh, maybe first one? Oh, no. It was the middle one again. 
That's that's the that's the first one. Yay, I did it. I'm amazing at hide and seek. You win. <sighs> Furball, he's so cute. Let him help you when you reach the low pipes. Okay. The low pipes. Well, good thing I went into that pipe that I jumped off of Arnold. Um, how else would I gotten Furball? That's a... Oh, ooh. That's a very sneaky place to, to hide. Uh. There was a Tweety Bird kind of character. Um... Damn, I forgot her name, like Sweetie Pie or something like that. Um, she was uh, pink instead, and she was just a, a more oh I can't go there a more kind of evil version. Oh, that's how it would have that would have led me to back where Arnold was. Uh, she was like a more evil version of Tweety Bird. It'd be kind of cool if the new Space Jam kind of referenced Tiny Toons at all, because like no one really remembers them that much. Oh, that's the light low pipes. He can go through the secret street. Thank you, thank you for a ball. Oh, am, am I controlling him? No. Oh, this is by itself, too. That's weird. <laughs> so, it's going to do that weird thing back when old old video games would do. So, like, because Furball can get through that, it counts as all of us going through that. Like, how does that work? Look, if Hampton can't fit into there, it doesn't matter if Furball can't. Hampton's not going there. Furball is going home to rest. And then we're just here. I'm sorry. Yeah, that's so weird. Oh, well, whatever. We a boss. We are no? Oh, a train. We are still in the big city, after all. Very fun. A lot of games had train levels back in the day. That's why games were better back then, right, Alec? Is that why? I agree. <laughs> Watermelon. Actually, yeah, I'm glad I picked Plucky for this uh, this level. His, um, pine... Yeah, oh, I can't go through that. His uh, pineapples actually came through pretty well. Though I wonder if... Um, I wonder if all, all the bosses are things... Oh, is that furball over there? I just... Kind of in the background there. Oh, or something. Something's there. It's very weird. Um, yeah, I wonder if all the bosses are like dizzy where it's not like straight up combat. Or if I'm going to have to actually fight someone. Because I want to kind of keep some pineapples. Oh, God. You're evil. I don't like it. No, no, no. Get away. Ah, oh, jeez. Oh, my God. Controls are very floaty. Keep it going. Oh, my God. Are you? No, you're not Arnold. Are you? If you are, you do not look like him there. Oh, whatever. Jump. Oh, God. Frog. Was oh, that the frog that like sings? Yeah, that's cute. Oh, jeez. This is cool. I like this a lot, actually. Oh, damn it. That's cool. There we go. Still want to be careful, though. Still want to not die. I gotta play my best for Dan. He believes in me. Nice. I can't get more than three. Boo! Oh, no, I don't like you. Get away. No, I don't like either of you. Go away. Um, go back to the service, maybe? Oh, hello. Do you want to play Montana Mash? Alright. I have 146 gems. Jeez, okay. Would you like the rules? Uh, use the button to move. Bop them with the A. Bonus for 150 points. Alright. Okay, let's go. Heh. <laughs> so it's not really Montana Mash. Oh, there's Montana. That's, that's uh, Montana Max, who's like the Yosemite Sam. Which is cool, because like they are both named off of real-world places, Montana and Yosemite. Uh, he's a spoiled rich kid in this game. Or, in, sorry, in, in Looney Tunes. It's a cool idea. Uh, oh, I, I did get over 150, so that's good. Oh, damn. 280. Not bad. That's it. Your score is 280. I will give you a present. Oh, thank you. Would have liked lives, to be honest. Some ammo's not really there. Let's really quit. Oh, you do it again? Oh, I quit. Damn. Let's try it again. Let's, um, let's try to do a little better. I'm gonna play. Oops. Damn. Uh, Alright. Concentrating. This is this is this is the hardcore stuff. Separates the men from the boys. Ah damn. Ah, I'm so bad at this. Looking for the Montanas too. Oh no, gotcha. Ah! 290. It's technically better. Oh well, more more things. I was hoping that if maybe I got 300, I'd get, like, points or, or uh, 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 lives or something, because I'm in, I'm in need of them. But we should be near the end of this level. I've got three hits, which is great. Nope, nope, nope. Knew that was coming. End of level. So if I can get to the next level and I do get a game over and then and this continues, then I'll probably start there, which isn't too bad. Oh, end of the track. Yay. Can I just keep going? Yes, I can. And 
basketball. Oh, Arnold. Oh, boss. There we go. Oh, another wimpy student. All the tunes in this town know I'm tough. I'll give you a test of strength, and if you succeed, I'll let you go. Even a small rabbit passed the test. Oh, Babs already passed the test, apparently. Ready to try? Okay. What do I do? There's basketball. Do I have to play basketball with you? Oh, God. Okay, so I can't jump on him. Ah, pineapple. Oh, God. That did not work. No, 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 no. Damn it. <laughs> oh, that's pretty funny. Yay. Good, good, good scores. How do I, what do I do here? Oh. Oh, okay, when, he's, when he stops. A little silly, but whatever. Oh, when he's like flexing and not paying attention. Ah, that's cute. I think he was like, I don't remember him the show. Ah, oh, damn. I don't remember him the show very well. Uh, but in Buster Bust Loose, he was like the campus security guard. Because even though I like, I've always thought as as the Tiny Toons characters as kids, I guess they go to Acme Acme Luniversity, which I guess means they're college students. I guess I don't know. I don't know how that works. This isn't too hard. This is definitely the closest thing to like actively fighting a boss, though. It's not super hard. All right, stop, stop. It's a pretty easy test, Arnold. Oh, it's like he has to get, like, f uh, far enough away from me to start posing. Yeah, it looks like it. Boink. There we go. Yay! <laughs> Screw it there. Wow, you are stronger than I thought. Go ahead. Thank you. Oh, nice. Oh, thank goodness. An extra life. <laughs> I don't like how you start over with two hearts, though. Performers like us have to have wit, wisdom, and warmth, but we also must have courage. Let's test our courage by investigating the haunted house in the forest that Fifi told me about. Oh, Fifi! Yeah, that's the girl version of Pepe Le Pew. Uh, Fifi Le Fume, I think. Take a deep breath. Okay, let's go. I forgot about her. Yeah, they added a lot more girl characters so that like, Babs had like her friends. I mean, they were all kind of friends, but like they had the girl friends and the guy friends. Um, so, you know, some episodes could be about that. Um, I thought that was really cool. Yeah, it was it was a good show. Man, I, I haven't watched it in like... Oh, God. What the hell was that? Oh, jeez. Okay. At least like 20 years now. Um, I should watch it again. Like, t in this day and age, you can watch pretty much anything you want at any time. Please give me hearts. I don't like how I got like hit by a thing I couldn't control. That was really careful. I should be Hampton. Actually, if these guys are around, then maybe Hampton's not a good idea. Because Hampton just hits on the ground because of his bowling ball watermelon. Um, I'll screw it. I got that extra life. Hampton. They all control exactly the same, so that's good at least. Thank you. Hampton's cute, though. I don't remember having a lot of, um, like, stories to himself, though. I can't remember. The one I remember the most was, I think most people, oh, they want to play Montana Match. Yeah, screw it. Um, was the, the, I don't know what it's called, but it was almost like a made-for-TV movie. I remember the animation just being a lot better. Whoa, is that like a scalpel? Jeez, Hampton, you look evil. Um, oh, it's like a ladle. Big spoon. Um, so, yeah, it was like about Hampton's family going to like a Walt Disney World kind of thing, a theme park, and uh, Plucky goes with them and it's like a road trip. And I forget what the other characters were doing. Um, Buster and Babs were doing something else. Um, I don't remember what they were doing. Wow, not a lot of time. 260, I did even worse. Oh, well, watermelons. Chibi just don't get a bunch of all of the, uh, all of the ammo. But yeah, I remember that episode being really, really good, and it was like, maybe not made for TV, but it was definitely, um, I don't know, it felt, it felt like maybe it was one of those, like, made for VHS or something. I cannot believe I didn't get it, but I'd be there. Alright, Hampton, careful. There we go. Careful of the things that fall. Oh, no, good. Maybe it's because that guy was hitting the tree or something, like the stump? Or oh, the trunk, I mean, not a stump. I, oh yeah, we're going to the haunt, I was like, why does it look so creepy? I forgot this was... All haunted. Poor Hampton. He's also like the scaredy cat kind of character. Very porky pig, I guess. I, I don't want to try if I can tell you. Oh, I can hit you with watermelons. That's good, at least. Ooh, what's this? Oh, invincibility. Yeah, back in the day, if it had an eye on it, probably meant invincibility. I feel like I can go faster, too, which is nice. Oops, well, I missed that. What's down here? Oh, Hampton. <laughs> this jump is so silly. Oh, is it gonna fall? Of course it is. Oh, jeez. No, it wasn't gonna fall. I just panicked like a little b -b 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 bitch. <laughs> uh, start right at that, like, haunted. D. Yeah, okay, cool. That's fine. It's fine. If I get a game over, I'll just meet you guys, obviously, where I die. Because, I mean, it's not gonna take me very long to get back to where I was. It's fun to kind of do a, a blind play every so often, just to kind of see. Like, with these kind of games where it's not really a problem if I'm, like, not super good at them at first. This is just, like, they're made for kids. 
Oh, I died once. You know, I'll go do it again. I'm gonna step here. Oh, oh, oh. Damn. That's not good. Um, I don't know if I can make this. Oh, nice. Good jumping, Porky. Not Porky, you're Hampton. I'm sorry, Hampton. Uh, there we go. Oh, does anyone remember the really dark episode, which was all about, I think it was all about drinking alcohol, where Bugs, Plucky, and Hampton all find alcohol and they start drinking. I think, what the hell? Ooh, okay. I think the, the the actual episode ends with them dying in a car crash. Like, I think jokingly, they were like, oh, sent to heaven, they were like angels and stuff. What did that do? Uh, but it was like, it was like a very serious episode in that sense. I don't remember very well. I just remember it being a thing on the internet for a while that people talked about. Like the, uh, I can't, oh, geez, I don't like you. Like the one of those, like, I can't believe they did this. Can I got past you? Okay. So, no. Huh. Let's try that again. I just want to see what that does. Look like a plunger, like I set off a bomb or something. Get, get out of your way. I did hit it. Eh, okay. Well, back down there to the, the bridge, I guess. Maybe it did something with the bridge. Like, maybe there would have been... Like, I wouldn't have been able to do anything at the bridge or something. Oh, no, it just goes here. I don't know, then. Oh, I probably have to find um, Fifi. I still didn't find her yet. That might be why. Keep forgetting that I'm supposed to find the characters, technically. Oh, there we go. Yay! Uh, my name is Fifi. I've been captured by the forest ghost. Find this button in the forest. Oh, I did! If you press the button correctly, you will be able to get me out. If you free me, I can help you. Please help me. That's that's a... Why would you put Why would you put her in there? Why do you have to find the other two, but you have to rescue the woman? <laughs> Not to be that guy, but like... A little silly. Oh, Fifi. You're adorable. Thank you. I will help you. You have no personality, because I'm pretty sure you're supposed to have, like, the French accent that Pepe Le Pew has. Oh, God. It's okay, Hampton. It's okay. Up we go. Any other ghosts? Okay, good. And is that going to do anything for me here? There we go. I was caught by you before, but now I will get even with you. That. <laughs> And, yeah, stinky this. Wow, those, that's like, stink line animates really well. <laughs> Down it goes. Why would the tree attack? Oh, whatever. It's, it's, it's a kid's game. It's just cool that they have all these characters in there, to be honest. Like, I like the idea that, like, the main characters are usually the four. Like, Hampton, Plucky, Babs and Buster, of course. But giving the other minor characters kind of some time to shine is a really good idea. I like the lipstick on the, the tree back there. Uh, Babs is farther ahead. Good luck. Yeah, thank you. That was awesome. Yay! And inside the Haunted Mansion, because we actually didn't get there yet. It's a fairly longish level. Oh, maybe this is actually it. Oh. Oh, damn. What the hell? Let's go up here. Maybe some... Oh. Well, that's good, too. I'm kind of just wondering if Montana Mash is the only, um... The only mini-game in the game. I mean, I don't know why I'm getting all these diamonds. Because I can play f uh, ten times now if I really wanted to. How many things do the other people have? Oh, well, I might switch to other, other characters if I need the ammo. The idea of the ammo is not a bad one, though, I guess. I like how it does make the characters different. Because I know the NES version of um, Tiny Toons, which I heard was extremely good. Wow. Oh, okay, at least I'm not dead. Um, how do I even get up there? Can't, can I jump that high? I'm scared to now. Uh, oh, because you can play as different characters in that one too, I think. I don't like this. No, I don't like this. Okay. Jeez, wow, everything's out to get me here. I don't like it. Uh, no, no, no. No! Oh, God. All right. Well, that's a game over. Let's see what happens. That's all, folks. No, it doesn't. At least it's continue. Oh, there was Go Go. Oh, if I get another game over, we'll, we'll go. Over. If we get another game over, uh, I'll, I'll um, kind of keep it there so we can see him. At least I got, I got a few continues, um, and I start right at the area, so it's as if I just died. So it's as if I have like nine lives or something like that. Like three lives per game over, and like three game overs. If I get another thirty thousand points, I think I got a one up. So, oh, but all my diamonds are gone. Damn, that sucks. Ah! 
And I guess the um, the ammo counts for my points at the end of every level, so I guess I guess that's like points. So I should probably try not to use uh, ammo if I don't need to. I'm learning. I'm learning, Danny. Oh damn. Yep. Oh my god. That was really close. Oh, there it is. <laughs> oh, I can move around while that was happening. That was cool. It was very Wario. Wario Land two and three. Down I go. Can I play a Montana Mash, please? Oh no. Well, this is good too. I wouldn't mind a heart. I don't like how rare the hearts are though. Jeez. Oh nice. Speaking of which. Good. It doesn't give me a third hit. Probably unless I have full life. Oh, better than nothing. And go. And alright, cool. Getting used to it. This is fun though. It's very basic, but uh Game Boy games back in the day were fairly basic. But uh ooh, I don't want to race. Okay. Uh, would you like the rules? Yes. Press A and B continuously to run. If you do not press A and B, you will walk. Okay, well, yeah. Uh, who do I want to race with? Oh, oh, it's Sweetie Pie. So Bookworm is a random character that I remember seeing, but I don't remember him in anything. Oh, Little Beeper! Yeah, the Roadrunner. Let's try Sweetie. Um, so just A, B, A, B, A. Okay. Go. Oh, jeez, she's fast. Oh, no, I'm faster. I, I didn't understand how the screen was working there. And yeah, go. See if I can do. If it, if it was just hammer one button, that's really easy for me. Hammering two buttons is a little harder. I know you can like rock the control. I don't know how to do that. I'll give you a present. Oh, lives! Holy shit! <sighs> no, let's stock up. Um, what happens if I f go against little beeper? All right, let's. Hopefully, he's fast though. Obviously, it's little beeper. Oh, oh, he's gonna go super fast. Oh my god. Oh my god. He's catched up. Uh, yeah! Wow, that was close, though. <laughs> Give me three lives, please. Oh, a heart. Well, I'd rather a life. Oh, you know what? That's fine. Um, this is not the kind of game where I'm going to, uh, you know, just grind for uh, almost all of it. If I do that, I do off screen. But hey, at least there's lives. Boss. Oh, oh, nope. I don't like the hands holding the can and the fork. That's <laughs> all right. Oh, boss. This is a boss room. Uh, oh, oh god. Uh, another visitor and I was not informed. I've been trapped here for 100 years because a, a spell was put on me. I let a rabbit go before, but I will not do it again. Who is this? Is he a character I know? He is not a character I know. You are- oh god. Uh. Oh. Okay. Maybe I can jump on that thing. You can jump, of course. Oh, jeez. Yeah. Okay. Oh, <laughs> that's funny. So what do I do? Oh, maybe when he throws his helmet. It's kind of a cool idea, I guess. Throw your helmet, please. There we go. Oh, whoops. Oh. Because that's not working. Why is this not doing anything? I don't know what I'm doing. Oops. I feel like I'm stuck here without knowing what to do. Jumping on him certainly isn't doing anything. Oh god. Take off your helmet one more time. I just want to see something. Okay. No? I want to kind of try to jump on the helmet itself when it's jumping around, but that feels dangerous. I'll try it out once. Damn it. If it doesn't work, though, I'm going to look this up. Because I clearly don't feel like I know what I'm doing here. This is the type of thing that would bother kids when you're, when you're a kid and it was in the internet. Oh, okay, it is that. Well, at least I get multiple hits. I don't like how that was the last thing I freaking tried, because I'm an idiot. You're gonna do the feet again, aren't you? Yeah. Maybe I can throw things at the feet when I'm ducking or something. That'd be kind of a cool idea. But it seems to switch between the two, so this shouldn't be too, too hard. Okay. Head, please. Thank you. Head again, please. Thank you. I can probably get three hits, though. I really want to be brave about it. I'll stay down here this time. Oh, God. 
Eh. Nope. <laughs> Alright, that didn't work at all. That's okay. Eh. Oh god. Uh, there we go. Ah, shit. Well, I tried for three hits, but I didn't get two. It's a fairly easy boss, though. Let's see if I can aim this. Eh. Nope, I'm close. Daffy's, or Daffy's, Plucky's actually a weapon might have worked really well there, but whatever. Alright, let's take you out. Boing. Boing. Nope. Oh, well, two's still good. Two's still good. That, that is seven hits on him, though. Jeez. So two hits. Or two, two. I, I have two hits for myself. <laughs> How are you levitating like that? You have a very strong, very strong chain to be able to do that. Up you go. You are a dull boss. Eight. Nine. No, nine. There we go. Yay. He falls apart. Oh. Very fun. <laughs> oh no, I've been beaten again. So is that how Babs is becoming an actor? She's just beating the crap out of bosses. Oh wow, oh wow, wow, wow. My acting days are here at last. Oh, we beat the game? Montana gets the theater, he'll close it. Oh, okay. With no theater, all my acting talents will go to waste. Please stop him from buying the theater. Well, I mean, he's got the money. He should be allowed to do that. I don't know where Shirley is. Oh, Shirley, yeah, Shirley Loon, yeah, but she can help you if you can find her. Uh, Shirley's special talents will be a great help. Montana's castle is very far away. If you go through oh, Calamity Coyote, that's like the Wily e. Coyote character. If you go through the fourth, Calamity the Inventor will help you use his inventions. Ha 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 ha. That theater will be my Oh, it's Montana. That theater will be mine. As soon as I buy it, I'll shut the theater down. Then I will build my own factory. Spelled wrong. I'm so wealthy that I will beat you at any cost. I'll tell you one more time, that theater is mine, 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 mine. <laughs> oh, that's great. That was great. This has got to be the last level. It's against Montana Max. Uh, and there's two characters to find in this one. Interesting. Calamity's Factory. Or it could be like this episode's The Factory and the next episode's Montana's Place. Oh, well, that was fast. Hello, Calamity. Um, he was Wily e. Coyote, basically. Um, except he wasn't... I didn't find him as aggressive as... Oh, Calamity's Bicycle does not look safe for a duck to ride. Hey, Buster, I'm getting off. I don't feel safe either. Riding too fast might make me fall and get dirty. That's the way it goes, Buster. I'm counting on you. Okay, since that's the way it is, let me do it. Really? Will I be okay? Oh, geez. So, like, I'll scroller? Oh, no! Uh, yeah, so Calamity was, like, just an inventor for the, like, invention's sake, while, while Wily e. Coyote was, you know, all about finding, or, uh, taking out the, um, the, the Roadrunner. Oh, God, that's, that's on my Well, that's not fun. Does that count as a life? Yeah, it would. Oh, it doesn't. All right. I can't go any faster. Oh, there we go. Oh, jeez. Uh, oh, God. Oh, no. Ah, uh, there's, um... Oh, dang, I don't remember your name. Yeah, you had a goofy voice. <laughs> Something like that. He was never super important, though, but he was he was always there. He was, like, a lighthearted character. No, get away from me, Amira. Amira, weirdly enough, got her own, like, kind of show with Pinky and the Brain. There's a whole story on that, how it was, like... I wouldn't say an inside joke, but it was the developers giving, basically, the middle finger to the head-ups. Um, because I guess they were forced to put her in there, and, I don't know, it was this whole thing. Well, there she goes, she's dead now. Whoa. Was her hair always a wig? Is that in the show? <laughs> that's funny. I don't know if she's related to Elmer Fudd, but her last name is Duff. Um, so I don't know if that's, like, like, she's technically not related. I, I just know that she's the, she's the hunter of the show, except instead of hunting them to kill them with a gun, like, like, um, like, uh, Elmer... Uh, you'd, she, she'd, she'd find them and like hug them to death, kind of thing. Oh God, I don't like. Oh, it's gonna be a maze, isn't it? I hate mazes. Oh no, two hundred gems, so many gems. Oh, do I want to race? Uh, let's get one life. Oh, damn. Um, actually, let's let's rest a little beeper. That way, I can get an extra heart. We're only gonna do one of these. So I don't want to race forever. It's sort of boring. <laughs> Ooh, that didn't feel like a really good one. Uh, <laughs> oh my god, he's so fast. Ah! Good. Give me lives and a heart? I'm okay with that. Oh, that's still better than nothing. I, I like having the three hits, so. If you really want to, I guess you really could get a ton of lives there. We're gonna continue. 
And if I get game over, that's my own fault. Do I want to play Montana? No, we're good, we're good. So I just, I found basically the bonus room area of the game. This must be the last level. They're really like, here, you can like get, oh my God, that was really close. It's like you can really um, uh, like stock up on lives and stuff here. Ooh, nice. Did I just get a one up by killing two things in one thing? That's awesome. Or that could be my points actually, now that I think about it. it. Sounds like it would be way too easy to get a bunch, ah, oh, damn it, lives to, to do that. Oh, hello. Tee hee 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 hee. I've been waiting for you. I'm Montana's bodyguard. Jeez, I caught your friend. I'm sorry, but I can't let her go. She will be my dinner tonight. Oh, at least you're sorry. As if I, oh god. Did not expect that. It's like the yellow devil from Mega Man. So what do I do? Keep going until he runs out of blocks? Maybe, actually. Oh yeah, I guess so. Oh, go, go, who's faster though? Uh, yeah. And why not? Boink! Oh, just <laughs> that's awesome. Ah, uh, there goes my dinner. <laughs> it's funny. This is a silly game. I like it. Oh, hello, Shirley. Oh, Shirley, he was talking about. Oh, you came to visit me. How now? I'm like totally safe. <laughs> yes, they kept her personality. I like that. That wolf has been annoying me with his bad karma. I've been thinking about how to escape in some junk. <laughs> Oh, the writer for this scene is great. Like, we are safe now, but as a result, looks like we won't be staying for dinner. Yeah, she was like the um, hippie kind of... Looks looks like a druggie there. Uh, she's the pothead character. No, she's she's the um, uh, mystical kind of one who had like the crystal ball and stuff. Now let's go inside Monty's totally awesome mansion. Oh, that's great. So what, what kind of power does she give me? Can I go on? Actually, can I go to the right here? No, okay. Um, actually, you know, just in case, this is the type of old school games where they're like, oh, you just go left here. Okay, just making sure, just making sure. That's all I'm doing. Continue up. We got a lot of lives. We should be fine, though. That's good. Good old Hampton. So I'm assuming that Shirley Loon was, like, supposed to be Plucky's girlfriend, I guess. Um, Hampton, I don't think, had a girlfriend or any, like, romantic prospects. I don't think, anyways. Oh, we're just back here. Okay. From now on, you can count on me. Oh, and she's like, uh, flies across. Oh, she <laughs> she yogas across. I love this. Again, I don't know how the three main characters are getting by, but whatever. Like, Plucky can fly. Can't he? He's a duck. Oh, jeez. Can I just control her and use her lightning abilities? So I guess that's like a mini level, I guess. So it's kind of right. Level was getting into there, and now it's getting there. Be careful of Montana. Now, is this a whole level, or is this just, like, the... a boss? Oh, it's a whole level. Uh, oh, yeah. There we go. Ah, <laughs> that's awesome! There's Montana. He almost always... Oh, God. Okay. Yeah, I didn't think I should plan that a little bit better. Um, yeah, Montana is, um... He's always portrayed, like, the exact sprite in every video game I see him in. He's usually the bad guy of... of of Looney Tunes games. I don't think he was the bad guy in um, Buster Bust Loose, but he definitely was a bad guy. Oh, this is slow goings, man. No oh, god. Ah, damn it. Well, I tried so hard and got so far, but in the end, Hamden got flatter. I don't know. Um, I remember the other one for Time Tunes for the NES was like, Wacky Worlds or something. It was an amusement park-based game. And that one was actually really cool. I like that one a lot. Um, I remember having Nintendo Power with it, and I just really like it. I only played it a couple times through emulation way back in the day. I think I own it now? I own the first one. I know that. Don't know if I own the second one. And I have the Sega Genesis one, I think. Um, Buster's Hidden Treasure. I mean, they made a lot of Time Tune games. That's like six right off the bat, right there, that I can name. There's also like a weird um, sport one for the Super NES. That's seven. Tenjus was pretty big, man. They had more games than Animaniacs did. Though the Animaniacs, I think, got a PS2 game out of nowhere. But then again, so did Tiny Toons. So, there you go. Uh, uh. Alright. This is, uh, not the funnest area. Is this the actual boss battle, too, or am I just getting to him? These look like he's, he has, like, vinyl records. Has, uh, has wheels. This is the worst part for a speedrunner of this game. Or they probably actually just take... Oh, no, I guess if you can't take damage, because, like, 
you were get thrown to the left there. Unless if you hit him, if he hits you when he's going to the right, he throws it to the right. Either way, Montana's a terrible driver. Oh my god, how much longer? Oh, there we go. Thank you. Oh, is that it? Yay! And now the fight. All right, cool. Ha 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 ha. So you showed up. You are braver than I thought. You think you're going to stop me from buying the theater? Ha, I'm a rich man and you're not, so I understand your problem. True. How about if I sell it to you for 500 gems? Oh! Oh my god, that's what the gems are for! No! You don't have that many gems! You're worthless, you know that. If you want to keep your theater, you will have to fight me for it. I wonder if you could skip the fight with 500... Or maybe he just goes, Ah, oh, it doesn't matter. I don't really need your gems. I don't know. You're too poor and weak to beat someone that is so rich, but if you must, let's go. Jeez, I didn't expect that. Oh god. Uh, yeah, it's almost like they always have, you always have to wait for a specific time for, ah, for them to, to be vulnerable. Ah, shit, that was real stupid to me. Okay, so he lands from the really tall jumps. Oh, he's going faster. And schmuckaboo. And big jump. Oh, this is going to be easy. And schmuckaboo. Oh, God. Ugh, that was really close. Come and get me. Yeah, wise acre. <laughs> oh, jump all the way over there because you don't have enough room to jump on there on the right. Oh, now I've, I've accidentally made this very, very easy. <laughs> oh, maybe not. Uh, ooh. Ah, damn. Right in the face. That was right in the face. That would have hurt. Oh, we start right here. I've got plenty of lives. Though the bosses do take. Oh, come on. Can I skip? No, I can't skip this. Blah, 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 blah. Man, I wish I had 500 gems, though. Oh, you have to say yes. Alright, let's do this again. Jump. Jump. Big old jump. One. Oh my god, really, Phil? This is not gonna end well, actually. Yep. Damn it, I really messed that up. All right, we got five hits on him so far. I very skipped to that point because it's a, it's a, it's a sort of boring boss battle as you can see. That's six. Shit, don't hit me. Thank you. Seven. You gotta be really careful too where how you jump on him. It's very easy to hit him on the side and uh, taking a hit. I really should have went for that. Found that heart though in the level which I did not find. That's kind of a downfall. That was nine hits here. Ah damn. I was hoping nine hits would be it. And ten, please. Oh, this sucks. Ugh. Oh, God. Oh, my goodness. No more. How many bunny bops can you take? There we go. Yay! Oh, jeez, that is a hideous picture. So much for my plan. Arr, I mean, you can still buy the theater. Nothing's stopping you. <laughs> <laughs> picture of Plucky. I'm so happy. Now I can... Oh, it's going by itself. Now I can continue my acting career. I guess that was that was it. That's all it took. She went to the, the city and then the mansion uh, and the woods. <laughs> That's right. This time I'm taking my act on the road. I mean, sooner or later I guess what's you're going to do. Over land and over sea. You guys can't be around her all the time. Plucky's at least give a thumbs up though. <laughs> Maybe even another galaxy. What? Hannon shouldn't care. He's just like, whatever. Sure, I'm gonna be a big... Star? Star. I'm so good at predicting what it's gonna say. Oh, that's it. Yay! Well, that was a lot of fun. It's very, very simple, but, like, I'm the type of kid who have loved this game as, as a kid. Oh, we get all the characters, too. Buster Bunny, Diz Devil. That's it. No. <laughs> They actually had a lot of characters from the show on this. Um, not a whole lot I can think of um, that weren't in this. I mean, the original Looney Tunes are in Tiny Tunes. They're the professors at the Lunaversity. But, I mean, I wouldn't put them in one of these games because that'd be like, what, what would be the point of that? But um, that was like almost all the characters. They didn't have, um, oh, dang it. He's like, ah, shit, Foulmouth. Foulmouth was like the Foghorn Leghorn slash... Um, chicken Hawk kid or whatever. Um, oh, and there's uh, the mouse Sneezer. Yeah, I don't know if Sneezer's based on anyone. And we got to see Go Dodo for like three frames. 
Oh, what's the buzzer buzzer's name? Congord Condor. Yeah, he he was never important. I don't think he had a whole episode to himself. Um, a ton of Max and just terrifying Babs Bunny. Terrifying. Now, actual credits for, you know, the people who made this game, or no? There we go, staff. Awesome. You really think it takes us that long to read staff, huh? No, there's the dogs outside. <laughs> Jeez, yeah, it's, it's weird how long it takes. Oh, that's a cool effect, though, to kind of keep going. But, yeah, no, um, if I was a kid and I had this game, I probably would have played it a lot. Um... I had a lot of, I wouldn't have, I wouldn't say a lot of kids, or a lot of kids, I didn't have a lot of kids when I was a kid. Um, I didn't have a lot of games when I was a kid, but I had enough that, like, like, I could kind of play my games and not get super bored. I had, like, four or five for the NES and, like, maybe six for the Super NES. Only about, like, three for the Game Boy, though. Um, but I'd, I'd rotate all, I'd rotate through them all, but I, I got to know the games I owned really, really well. Because, like, when you're a kid in, like, the 90s, the 80s and 90s, you only had so many games and you played the crap out of them. And this, this was a, this would have been one I would have liked a lot. Presented by Konami. All right, well, thanks so much for joining with us, guys. If there is a quickie that you'd like me to play, uh, check out my Patreon page. There is a list for every game that I would do for a quickie, and uh, you can find out there how you can pick one for me to do in your name, basically. I'm Funnel Blanks. I'll see you guys next level. Hey, thanks for watching. If you liked this episode, click that subscribe button and hit the bell icon to know when the next episode is up. If you want to support my channel, share some videos with some friends and consider supporting me on Patreon.